He did that, I think, did he? Anyway, so we got a wobble. So I'll tell quickly how the last set between them went. Did you huh. watch it? 2-0? 2-0. Or... They're both last dog, but... Okay. Wow. I call these buster chips. Because they barely have any taste. Barely have any taste? 99 cents? It's what you can afford when you lose the tournament. Yeah. So what Farcook just did there? MBK, you up, are Matt. so free. Actually, that is true. Free for days. <laughs> Alright, so Farcook's Lost a match. My Fark statement doesn't even matter anymore. I think Frack is starting to lose some. Uh, he's starting to run low on steam right now. Yeah, I think. Uh, I think he thought he would win last set. Oh, yeah. the player games are really in the wrong spot. Oh. Dude, you just yeah. Really. There we go. Oh, so we're starting off really well. I looked yeah. away and uh, Zeng's just embraced within the two. A wonderful tapping sound. We can all do it. You can wobble, I can wobble. It's good. Frack can also wobble. Yes. The hard part is their neutral game, without doubt. Punish game, you know, it's like, when I see neutral, it's like, oh, I gotta somehow get a grab. But I'm these two shitty little Eskimos. <laughs> Figure it out. These two shitty little Eskimos. Oh, messing up the down throw regrab. Spooky shit Eskimos and shiver down my spine. Um, MPK, you want a hundred dollar money match? Probably not, because I'm broke, but... I have to stop getting conceited that I beat Chainers. I can't let it get to my head. Or you let it grow, and then you just beat every Falco ever. Except because, like, for me. Cause... Because, like, the Pudgy Panda thing. Pudgy Panda, like, acts like he's the best player in the world because he beats on two, right? And I don't want to be like that. We'll save that for later. Anyway. He acts, very, he acts like, oh well, I mean, so I'm gonna win. I mean, Sun 2 also kinda has that attitude. Where uh, he acts like he's better. Yeah, but he's actually kinda good. He is. <laughs> I agree. But I think that gets in his head sometimes. Having him sometimes rage quit, you know. Good guy, though. Good guy, though. Yeah. Yeah, I go. <laughs> so, I kinda like the stage sometimes. Uh, rip. For Falco. So Frackuck is playing exponentially worse than he was throughout the rest of the bracket. Getting tired. Yeah, I think he is actually. I would be tired too if I literally was just staring at a clock for like an hour and pressing the same button. Yeah, right? <laughs> Poor guy. It's, it's almost like he's mesmerizing himself. He just like went to sleep sometime during it. But yeah, if I ever meet Chainus again in tournament, I'm probably gonna lose. But I'm gonna keep getting better, so I don't have to worry about it. It's a bad attitude. I mean, I'm just gonna play my heart out and see what happens. Like, I wasn't afraid of losing. I was like, I'm just gonna try my hardest to see what happens. Yeah. That's pretty much how my mindset going into it. And that's the best way to go into it. Yeah. That's the way you pull an upset. You just play your hardest, you know? You don't be like, oh, I just hope I don't. Oh. And nice wobble. <sighs> yeah. A toast. Yep. To wobble. Zang almost living. Oh. No chance. We're getting so, really close to 2,000 followers on Twitch. Really? Yeah, 114 away. Wow. Well, I think he quit out again. Yeah. Um, oh, and he actually died, though. He was, he was winning. Yeah, and then, yeah, he, and then um, he stopped winning. Zang's up 2-0. Farko kind of just, not Farko, Zang, down aired a bunch. If he keeps his mindset up, he's going to get 3-0. Yeah. No chance. Yep. I, I think he's one of those players that does that, though. You know, He takes his losses bad. He takes his losses bad, takes a trip to Green Greens, and plays friendlies in the corner for the rest of the tournament. <laughs> I just said that. Rip. I mean, it, it's true. Yeah, no, it is. 
I'd be sad too. Because he always loses close sets. Yeah. Oh, that was cute. He didn't fuck up. That's good. Oh, God. What? Speaking about people that have beaten Firecook. What's up to... Shout out to everyone that's ever beaten Firecook. <laughs> yeah, shout outs. Shout out to Kavorki for yeah, beating Kavorki, him on Saturday. Uh, good shit. He beat him on Saturday. Yeah, and he also beat Yeti. Yeah, he did in a doctor. Yeah, that was cute. He I played didn't out see of his it, mind. Yeah. I, I'd have to, I actually didn't see him play, but I had to imagine. I was looking at the bracket, and it was like, you versus Chainace, and then his little bracket run, and I was like, all right. Did he beat Zodiac? No, Yeti beat Zodiac. Everyone played really well. Speed about playing well, we got a wobble from Frycook. It was kind of like a blizzard into a grab, and then this happened. It's a wobble, though. Isn't this hype? Yeah. Have you ever tried getting hype for a 28-minute match? It... Is borderline it's impossible. <laughs> People go and get pizza. <laughs> so if there's one thing about Fry Cook is he is very patient. So didn't the whole venue just leave them alone and they just kept doing it? Uh, essentially, a couple of us were watching. That's funny. We kept getting a time check, so we had someone with a timer and put it out. But anyway, it looks like Fry Cook's gonna take this as long as he does not fuck up. So he's got to keep up that mindset because at first he, lo he got he lost that first stock pretty bad. Oh, yeah. Oh, there you go. And there's a game. Yep. Fry Cook puts one on the board. Uh, I mean, he's stuck playing against Zhang's counterpicks. Yeah. But, but at least he's got a little bit of a better mindset going into it. Yep, he did beat Zhang before. So. Yoshi's is coming out. This is a good stage for Ices. Wow. Except for maybe in this matchup. What Zang, do you think about this matchup? This matchup, I kind of enjoy it. But, see, on this <laughs> stage, Nana will die really easily. You know, off the top. Like, he could just keep doing the shine up B. Nana's not DI, so. So, this match is fun, you know? It's like, the second you separate them, you just. You have fun. You just go in, you know? I mean, lasers kind of help, right? They, yeah, they do. You can. I mean, Zang's not doing that, but you can camp, you know, top platform, and then one on the other side. That's funny. Zang usually likes to camp. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. You know, but yeah, see, he waits. And then the second, wow. Because he has a lead right now, so. Frycook has to put himself in the unfavorable position just to get in. I don't know. It's yours now. Did Sirocco lead? Yeah. He do stuff. That's it. You know. Hey man. This will just find us. So I just wanted to point out that everyone loves my sh <laughs> all these shirts. They're so The cool. HBA shirts, They're people amazing. love them. I love this shirt, too. I'm wearing to get day. Team Space ones. You guys should have gotten them earlier. Well, I mean, we MGFC had... MGFC has them, too. We had shirts in line, but... MGFC has shirts. We have shirts. I think that's the only two How much do those cost? <laughs> wow, Zhang is playing... In fact, Zhang's up four stocks. Okay, Fry Cook shaves off the first duck in the match. Fry Cook feeling a little defeated right now. If Nana's, I promise you, if Nana dies, he quits the match. I promise you. That was actually a really nice jab. So I can promise you, Frygook's gonna quit if Nana dies. Or oh, I'm calling um, it right now. All right. 
He doesn't have to, because he's dead. Didn't have to worry about it. Anyway, it's a quick 3-1 for three Zhang. Oh, boy. It's one of these grand finals. Yeah. Who's 